Hello folks and welcome back to Let's Play Techno's Deception. I'm your host, the Gamer Darius. Last we left off, we had mercilessly kind of murdered a family that was all about getting my head so that we, they could pay for their daughter's uh, operations to get better. I'm not a very nice guy. Anyways, uh, I slipped up a little bit on when I was talking about this whole selecting target system and getting other people around. What it is, is that you can only summon, let's see, da -da -da. you can actually attempt to lure up to six members, up to four may arrive. Some invaders are less likely to be lured than others, well, with the rare types being harder to lure. In order to be available to lure, at least one specimen of that type ha must have been defeated before. This means that blah 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 blah. Now you must lure the two component invaders and no more than one other of the new invader to arrive. So yeah, I messed that up in trying to summon up two new invaders when I just can only do one. So hopefully I will be able to do something with a so soldier and an archer. And for shits and giggles, let's get a pirate or merchant. Yeah. So if this doesn't do anything for, if this doesn't do anything at all, then I'm going to just move on to the next chapter. Cool. Cool. Damn it. Oh, there we go. A new invader, the digger, is here. Oh, because it was based off of the archer and the merchant. Not at the soldier and the archer. Well, that's a little bit funky. Oh well. And the invader lured. Yeah, was lured with the thing. Okay. Cool. So let's check out how the merchant is. The merchant. Uh, sorry, how the digger is. Matthew the digger. Which seems like he's going to be on the second layer. Second floor, rather. Um, let's see. I'm gonna want to weaken these guys a little bit. And I think that soldiers. I can't remember if soldiers are. Well, naturally, soldiers are probably worse against the crane game than anything else. Probably. I don't know. I'd have to more thoroughly look at this walkthrough, but I've not looked at it that thoroughly yet. That in the crane game is just funny. Okay, this will be uh, interesting. It's actually been a couple of days since I last played this. I usually like to go on gaming binges for this. Oh, one other thing, I think. Now that I have the evil ring, I can go to the altar. What's in the altar? Well, nothing more than the High Lord Satan himself. Yep. Just to, just to make it a little bit more real, they decide, oh hey, by the way, you you can look upon and gaze upon his high lord evilness, Satan. Nothing really else to this room besides just, hey, here's Satan. It's, it's kind of weird like that. And... Then, in order to go back, you just go into this mirror where your reflection doesn't show. Yep, that's about it. It's all there it's a, that's in that mirror. Maybe every now and then I'll come back this way to look at the stuff that I find, but, you know, uh, no real purpose to that. I already have it in my rooms. And that's the digger. Whoa. Oh. Oh, there's the merchant. Whoa. And bye bye. 24 damage. Right, right. He's a hardy guy who's got a lot of HP. Now, if only I could hit him like one more time. Oh, wait. That's right. I also kind of want to buy stuff from you. Uh, actually, I 
keep on holding on to things that I don't need to hold on to. These TRs and aim... Well, you can use the amulets for MP, but... <laughs> tiaras you don't, like, ever need. So you can just sell those. And... Yeah, I guess I'll buy a couple of MP gains just in case. You never know when you're going to be low on the... MP. Well, you don't know when you're going to be low on the anything. And the monster blocks, I don't know how many you can have maximum. I think you can only have up to 99. But, you know, it's one of those things. It's just one of those things. If you're trying to hit me through a pillar, natural selection dictates you should die. Okay, that's probably that other one going into the other room. Come on, Mr. Merchant, stop being all days. I gotta deal with a digger. Wait. Okay. For a second there, I thought it was the... I'm suddenly rather glad that I put the uh, cranes up here. Come on. Ah, right, crap. The only downside is that I think the digger is faster. That and he kind of teleports much like the ninja does. Which, of course, can be annoying. And all you're trying to do... Uh, God damn it, Mr. Matthew the Digger. In some D&D &D games, that's considered a racial slur against dwarves. I don't know who actually uses it. Really? Really, Matthew? You use that to teleport two whole squares? How much HP? Ow! Alright, stop looking at Al. Look at Matthew. How's Matthew doing? What's up, pal? Whoa. Oh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Come this way. And play Darius's green game. Uh, or do that. Ah, damn. Well, that's one use of the crane gun. Come on. I think the only downside to these, though, is that you can get injured whilst you're sitting there waiting to capture the guy, so... Be very careful when you do go to use those. Ah, <coughs> uh, gold. Because if I can get an all capture bonus, that'd be fantastic. Damn it. Alright. Not the crane game against the diggers. If anything, I want to say the bear trap. Maybe the bear trap? I don't know the bear trap. I'll end up just catching Matthew here and then I'll move on to the next chapter. Because once again, they put their save areas. Such wonky points. They're all like, oh hey, you want to save before you go and capture a guy, but not after you finish a chapter? It's like, no. No, I want to save before doing both of those things. W would you allow me to save before doing both those things so I don't have to play through an entire section if I mess up? Nah. Alright. Mr. Digger? How's it going, Mr. Digger? Um... Was that one whole square of movement really necessary? Okay. I really... We're... I swear... Ah! Okay, I think he legitimately dodged that one, I can't tell. Yep, he's dodging the everything. <laughs> it's going to be one of those NPCs. Okay. I so happen to have the list of stuff here, so... One moment. Okay, so apparently it's not an all-inclusive list about information. It's just, hey, 
here's the thing about a couple of the guys. It doesn't have, like, oh, what they're best against or weakest against. They have some gentle selections. Actually, yeah, let's look at Matthew. Agility, wow, he's actually pretty good against most of them. The weakest against magic, though. So I guess eventually the crane will be the best. You know, pursu pursuing him with that seems like the best of ideas. Yeah. So I don't know if you guys know this, but this is something I forgot to bring up last, well, the last couple of episodes. Wherein I need to tell you guys that this game actually has multiple endings. There's the good, and technically it's eight, but it's really six in that, you know, they all do more or less the same thing. God damn it, stop dodging all the things. I will hit you eventually, sir. Much like that. All right. With Matthew at only 13 health, I should be able to catch him if either of these actually work. But yeah, there's eight endings, like eight different paths you can go. And it's all dependent on how fast you do certain things and what options you do at literally only the very last two chapters. Yes! Got him. Whew. Uh, yep. And I don't fully know which endings I'm going to go for. I just know that, you know, endings. But if my poll from Fable 2 is going to tell me anything, you guys are going to want me to go for the super mega evil ending, which, I don't know, we'll see. But in any case, I'm going to go ahead and get to the next session, well, section, because I, you guys have already seen me kill soldiers and archers before. So I'll see you guys in just a moment. Okay, so I just leveled up and I actually got a new capturing ability called Magnet. This one is actually pretty damn hilarious, so I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what it is. And it is, it is fantastic. Uh, yes, this one, yes. Although I did waste a bunch of traps in the first place, but hey, victims are pulled to the underworld. That's right, I freaking straight up, uh, uh, what is it? Ah, uh, I forgot what it's called from Yu-Gi-Oh. Mind crush them, you know, send them to the underworld, or... Send them to the nether realm or whatever it's called. There he is. Yes. I have you now. Whop, 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 whop. Pulled into the underworld. His money shall line my pockets. That's a fantastic mission clear. Only one that really gave me much trouble was the digger. Oh well. End of invaders. Yeah, it took me like five in-game hours just to kill Matthew. Wait, no bonus. Was this shenaniganry? Oh well. That's one of the reasons why you buy those MP goddamns, whatever they're called. Ah. Uh. Okay. Okay, got quite a bit back. But now we move on to the next chapter. Messenger. So sinister sounding. Oh, hey. Is he still alive? Yes, Kane told me. Kane is your fiance, right? I can't thank him enough. 
Since you are the only one I can turn to, would you do me a favor? Please take my letter to my love. Yes, princess. Who's over there? That's a really empty, barren-looking room. Seems to be no one here. That's strange. Also, very, very full of yourself to have a picture of yourself hanging on your own damn wall. Just saying. What? My brother is alive? What? What? How could he have been spared? What? Fiona has sent him a letter? Go kill the maiden messenger. I'll decide what to do about my brother later. So I believe in this chapter, we're literally going to go up to the messenger lady, say hi, she'll go away, then we'll face the ninja. Prince Darius, please come out. This is Cheetah. I keep on saying Cheetah, not Cheetah. But with the knowledge that I have in my head, I'm going to go ahead and preemptively set up some traps. Uh, oh, those were the capture traps. I forget, what was the best against ninjas? I want to say it was the ton weight. Or at least the ton weight did a butt ton of damage to the ninjas. And then I'm going to see if the magnet doesn't work on the ninjas. I love the magnet. I keep on doing that. If the magnet doesn't work, I believe it was the copper cage? I don't know. We can't look at the stats of the invader in the first place, so... Otherwise, I would totally look at his stats, Mr. Ninja's stats. Also, the way that my brother talks in this game, where he's literally trying to understand the things that were coming out of his mouth. What? This thing happened? What? Then that thing happened? What? I don't know what I'm not even talking about anymore. Not the uh, most confident of rulers, is he? Which only makes me think, how is this nation going to be run once both he and I are set and gone? You're Darius. I'm Cheetah. I have a letter from Fiona. Um. Uh, you probably don't want to stand there. It's really you. You're alive. I brought you a letter from Fiona. She's worried about you in such a scary castle. Seriously, Cheetah, you don't want to be standing there. Y you might want to leave. I, I must leave now. There's this creepy crane game thing going on right over my head. I really don't want to be involved in that. Aw, oh, she still cares about me. The Princess Fiana, not Cheetah. Cheetah might care about me. Hope she lives a long life. I spoke too soon. Oh, there's two guys. Kabados. Weird name. Don't eat too much bread. Did you do it? Yes. Let's leave. Wait, they actually leaving or are they coming to kill me? Because that's kind of an important distinction here. They're coming to kill me. He'll do anything for me. Can often be found in the pub. Feel you there, Gabros. Feel you there. What is known about this Zemikia... Member of Zemikia Assassins. Ooh, an assassin amongst the, the hunters for me. That's all right. I just want to mercilessly torment their souls and then probably turn their bodies into monsters. Yes, I'm pretty sure that's that's all I need to do. Although I'll probably lay down like one more copper cage. Again, it's a case of I don't really remember which one of these abilities and whatnot are more effective against these guys. I think they're both in the beginning area. Yes, they are. Sup, guy? Um, have a ton- wait- oh, jeez, I missed. How did I miss? He was three feet in front of me. Hi, Gadget. Okay, this is the magnet. 
I hate when I forget my own damned traps. Where are... Okay. Here's the other ton weight. Right. They're super dexterous against the ton weights. I'm just going to run over here now. Be all like, oh, woe is me. No one can stop me. Because there's a pit. 24 damage. Is that enough? I'm hoping that's enough. As I don't remember laying down. Yep. Nope. All the rest are capture traps. Hey. 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 Carbados. Oh. I guess he didn't like that, uh, bread joke that I had for him. Ah! Balls! You know, in hindsight, it was kind of stupid of me to go, Oh, hey, maybe all the physical traps would be best against the hunter. I need a drink! You and me both, sir. Except it's a little early in the morning for me, so... I don't know. I got coffee. That counts as... It's a drink. I'm drinking it. Wow, this guy had two block orbs? Okay. Also, each of these enemies has a small chance of dropping uh, stat-increasing orbs. Wait. Oh, he's on the second level. Balls. Okay, we'll go to this. Actually, let's set up down here first and then go to the second level and deal with Mr. Ninja. Bong. Bong, bong, bong. Sinister music. I really need to download this music just for like a stream or something. And yes, I totally don't remember what it is that's best against ninjas. Again, I want to say it's ton weights, but I think the ton weights might just end up destroying him. Who do we got? No, it, it might do a lot of damage, but I don't think it'll straight up kill him. Hopefully it won't. Alright, let's try to use the bear trap on him. I don't think we've already seen the bear trap, but in case it doesn't work... I will have myself a cage just over there ready to capture him with. Ah, oh, man. I don't know about you guys, but it's really good. It just feels good in general to go back to games from your past. I almost want to make it all that sort of the exclusives, the exclusives, exclusive sort of content that I provide on my channel. I don't know. Oh no. He ninja vanished. Oh jeez, he ninja vanished again. Where did he ninja vanish to? Uh. Haya? Sir? Ugh. It's kind of creepy when they. Oh, no, that's the bear trap. Ow. Oh well. Have a ton of weight. There we go. That's more than enough damage. Uh, at least I think so. Seeing as the bear trap, I th think does it. Oh. Ha <laughs> ha! It is my place to question authority. Um. Good for you, Haya. Haya? Huya. Huya! Okay. That's enough of that. Well, that wasn't such a bad chapter, was it? You know, save all the maiming, murdering, killing. Oh, okay, I captured them. They're all probably just hanging out in the coffins in my prisons. Uh, all capture bonus. Not that impressive when you consider that there were only two. Time bonus, nice. Trap successful rate, nice. Only took two whole damage. Yeah, you start with a thousand and you lose ten points every time you get hit for for each HP. So I'm going to go ahead, call an episode here, and when we return, we shall be going on to the next chapter. Ooh, spooky. So I'll see you guys in the next episode. Take care. Cheers.